Hey guys, guess who it is? Can you guess? It's me. So guys, yeah, ASMR. So, that's, mm. so, <sighs> I'm really sad. Can you guess why? Inktober's ending. Well, it ended. So, um, I'm going to give you a tour of my full Inktober illustrations. Now, I'm sorry if you hear weird sounds. My microphone is, like, tangled with my tripod for my camera, and I'm, like, recording the two things at the same time, so I want to know if I have them in sync or not. This table's really dirty. Okay, so first we're going to start with day one, poisonous. Now, this... J I just dropped all of them. I swear to... Okay, okay, I'm done. Um, wait, was this even the right order? Yeah, okay. I got it now. Don't worry. Um, okay. My computer also, like, completely glitched out, so it's like 11 o'clock right now. I'm recording this. I want to get to bed, because, you know, school the next day. I'm recording this the night before Halloween, just so you know. So anyways, this is... Um, prompt number one, poisonous. Now, I've come a long way, I feel like, you know? So, there it is. I'm not really going to say much about it, because I have nothing to say. Here's number two, tranquil. I think I got better, like, <laughs> with this one. Um, all of them are different sizes, because I just didn't cut them accurately. This is prompt number three, roasted. I like how this came out. I like how the grandmother came out the best. She looks so cool. And the turkey, ooh, delicious. You know, that's so delish. What just happened? Okay, I thought my computer just deleted the recording. Never mind. I heard a sound. Okay, then here's prompt number four. This was actually my favorite for a while, but it's not my favorite anymore, I don't think. Yeah, so this was um, Spell. So that's that. She's a witch turning herself into a dog. Don't you love her? Okay. Boom, you're dead. Wait, what? Um, so here's prompt number... Wait, I wrote them down on the back, as you can see. I wrote down when I drew it, what it was, and I idiotically wrote 2018. I wrote 18 there, and then I wrote the prompt. So this was um, number five, day five, and the prompt was chicken, so they're like chicken balloons. This boy's like, well, man, you know, there you go. Uh, this one was day six and drooling. So this girl's like, I want some delish food, you know? Okay, so that's that. I'm not really going to go through these in so much detail because I already did in other videos. Um, this is prompt number seven. Yeah, day number seven, exhausted. Now, I love how this kid came out, but the mother, what kind of hair is that? Like, is, is that a wig? Like, a really bad wig? It's delish. Okay, so I like that one because I can relate to it because school is exhausting. Um, this is day number eight, Star. I love this one. Like, it's one of my favorites. Like, my earlier ones? Yeah. So here's prompt number... I'm going through these really quickly. Um, prompt number nine, Precious. It's like a porcelain ballerina thing holding a diamond. This one is day number ten, Flowing. So it's just like flowing in the air, and her hair looks like paper, and there's ghosts. There you go. Um, just looking that it's still recording my voice. Cool. It is. This is prompt number 11, cruel, which it's like lobsters being cooked. And it's like, you're cruel, man. He's saying to him, and he's like, what is wrong with you? That's like me. Because one time my dad, I walked in on my dad cooking lobsters. I flipped out. I seriously fell for them. I don't know why. Um, this one was one of my favorites for a while. This one is day 12. The prompt is whale. So that's that. I love this one. Like, he's like riding whales. And there's like whales in the sky. I love it. Um, I love how the color goes with it, too. This one, um, day number 13. I, I said that was day number 12, right? I don't know. Maybe I did. I don't know. Um, day number 13, the prompt was guarded. So there, there you are in all of its glory. The little cat has like a king's crown on. He's like, I'm going to guard you, cat. Yeah. Um, that's all I got to say about that. This one, what is that face? Like, there's something wrong. Like, no. Ew, my nail. I worked with charcoal last night. 
because I was drawing with charcoal and it's like I can't get it off my hands. Um, this was 14 o'clock. So she's like rushing. She's like paper and pencils. She's like, well, the school bus is here. Oh my god. So yeah, that's that. This one, prompt number 15, week. I like that one. It's just, you know, a deeper one. This guy being called names, like, by texting, I guess, text messaging. This prompt, this prompt, this stack is, like, really messy. Okay, um, number 16, angular. So it's, like, an angular sort of teacher teaching geometry or angles. I like that one a lot. Okay, then this one is prompt number 17, Swollen. I like this one a lot. This one is one of my favorites, like, overall. Um, I like the yellow. I like this guy's look on his face. It's just funny. How long have I been recording for? Six minutes. Okay, I want to try to get this done fast. Um, prompt number 18, Bottle. This one is also, like, not one of my favorite favorites, but it's a good one. You know, it's not, like, my favorite. I don't know why. Like, I think it looks good, but I just, I guess I can't relate to it as much, maybe? I don't know. This one, prop number 19, Scorched. So this is this hula dancer guy. I didn't, so from 18 on, I didn't show them on YouTube. I only showed them on Instagram, which you can see, but I'm going to show them now. So this is this hula dancer guy, you know, like the the Hawaiian guys who, like, juggle fire. I wanted it to be like he burnt himself because he's, like, practicing, and he got scorched or burnt. So, yeah, that's that. This one, <laughs> like, absolute hell to make this one. It was crazy. So this is, like, <laughs> this prompt number 20, it's broken. Now, it's like a pop-out sort of piece. It's this kid who broke his, like, a plate, and the sisters got the glue, which I can sort of relate to, like, the sister and brother bonding. Um, why is there stuff happening on my computer? There's, like, noises. Okay, so then I put, like, shiny paper under it. It has, like, imprints of circles, which I'm really annoyed about, but... And it's the window, so these are like the window panes. They're actual paper that I put on top that I colored in with marker. And then under that, I put this shiny stuff. And then under that, I put the background, which I really like, but it took so long to make. And it was, I just realized I have to organize these, this whole stack over. Because I, I want to start with one on the top, but now I'm going to start with 31 on the top. Darn it. Okay. I didn't think that one through. This one, one of my favorites. Um, this is number 21, Drain. So, like, this person, he's, like, at zero battery, and there's, like, wires connecting to him, like, telling everyone, whoa, he's at zero percent, gotta charge up. Yeah, I love this one. I don't know why. It's just the swirls and the guy's face. I love when they look like that. They look really depressed. Don't you love that? That's delish. Okay, I'm not gonna stop saying delish. Okay, this one really good one expensive i thought what's expensive copic sketch markers like come on that's cool so i did like the full-on detail like the barcode the number that stuff that stuff i didn't want to write so i just scribbled then the fine liner thing and then like you could see a little bit of the like name on it um and this guy he's like and i love this these colors by the way together and this guy he's like holding it up like oh and there's like two or three over here I love these colors together. They just make it look so neon and beautiful. So that's that. There's noises. Why, computer? Okay, nine minutes. Jeez. This is where the rebellion starts. The rebellion. Wait, did I? Yeah, like, this is really where the rebellion starts, but this is, like, full-on rebellion. This, yeah, color started to seep its way. So in a day, I went from... I did drain through which was 21 through, um, 21 through, I think, 27, yeah, so I did that was in a day, I was really happy, so I guess colored, I don't know, it was the weekend, I was just really happy, so this one is prompt number 23, muddy, so I wanted to do, like, muddy water, so the squid is, like, the ink and the fishes are like wow 
you know, this water's pretty muddy in the seaweed. It's like folded here on some spots, like they're in the rocks. And this squid is like, Whoop, whoopsie. <laughs> so, yeah. So this one is also one of my favorites. Um, which one is this? Uh, let's see. 24 Chop. So this guy, he's like, a, a, what's it called? A hibachi chef. And he's like, whoosh, 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 whoosh. and this kid over here is like, oh, well, you should be careful. Um, you know, and there's like smoke. He's going crazy. He's like, whoa, there's sounds. I swear. You know what? Never mind. We're just going to plow through this. Okay, this is prompt number 25, Prickly. So I wanted to do cacti and stuff. Well, one cactus. Um, and he's being like prickled, I guess. Like a lot of the thorns and uh, what do they call them? The, yeah. Wait. The needles, that's it. I'm an idiot. Okay. And he's like in a desert and it's like the needles are like poked on him. He's like, wow, I just ran right into that cactus. Didn't even see it there. You know, bright yellow whatever okay so then number 26 stretch now this one not my favorite I mean I like how I shaded these things like I love that neon looking shading with that dark blue um the flower cutting I don't care for it but the person like the shading on the legs it like seeped through do you see that it, like bled a lot I don't know um my camera seems super clear today I don't know why so anyways, it's this guy just stretching up, and he's, like, reaching the cookies. As you can see, it says cookies on it. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah. My camera feels really clear today, but it's not focusing. There we go. Okay. 27. Now, this is Thunder. Now, I got a comment that will always stick with me. They said, artistic response from one artist to another. Uh, artistic response artistic respect from one artist to another keep inspiring are you kidding me yes thank you you're awesome so this person has like over 6,000 followers and she's an amazing artist I have to get her name I mean if you look on my Instagram and look on this post you'll see her comment thank you so much um so next one um I, well actually i just want to talk about this one i like how i did the thunder like one main th lightning bolt and then those little branched out things and the um clouds are like farther in the background so they don't have like outlines and then the grass is darker and they're like abstract clouds you know which i like how long has it been 13 minutes okay um, this one is prompt number 28, gift. So I had this kid who's like, his gift is art. Like, he's gifted. Um, and he's showing this photographer. She has, like, a camera. See that? Yeah. It's an art museum. And these is, these is, this is his art. And he's, like, holding up the paper. And she's like, look at this. So I like how they're all orange and yellow. And then they're just, like, blue and purple. Which I love that color combination, as you saw with expensive. Um... And she's like, whoa, these are really cool. I love how she came out. Like, really? She's one of my favorite humans that I've ever drawn. Probably my favorite. Like, look at the beanie. Look at her hair. Look at the sweatshirt. Look at the pants. Like, I love her. This, that. Yes. <laughs> okay. Now we're getting into what I did tonight. <sighs> Tonight's the 30th, by the way. Um, This is prompt number... 29 double I didn't know what I was gonna do so I made this weird creature that's like gooey and stuff and like sticking together with goop and their heads are conjoined like as you can see um and they're really creepy and there's two of them conjoined the moon's like black the trees are black and I wanted to put like gray instead of black where the blacks meet you know so it's not like one big black blob like this shows like where the hands are i haven't done that before so that's why i'm so bad at that so one has like antlers that one has like a puff of hair those have horns and they're like dripping this monochrome goo which i think is like this is starts where like i started to get a little bit more with the grays but then this one i did grays and browns and then a yellow so this one is jolt day number uh 30 
so this this girl who's being struck by lightning and her hair is like all spiky like and there's like things coming off like whoa and she's like shining yellow so let me give you a closer look so that's a storm crowd i love how that came out the like the texture and stuff and the um the grass is gray because why not and her clothes and stuff are brown like brownish gray gray like a warm gray okay guys this is where it ends this is where i cry i'm seriously gonna go in the corner after this and just i'm probably not i'm just gonna go to sleep anyways this is the last one i forgot to pff, i was gonna say warning if you're afraid of blood don't look but too late um <sighs> i'm so sad inktober was so fun I don't know. Anyways, let me talk about this one. So this is day number 31. The prompt was slice. I love you, Inktober. Goodbye. Actually, wait. Let me talk about this. Um, so here is this kid <laughs> who's being sliced up. Like, you can see. Like, do, do you want a closer look? Like, see that? Do you love that? Isn't that delish? So, um, this kid who's being sliced up, like, you can see that he's being sliced up, and you can see, like, under, like, you can see the shirt is sliced, and also his skin under it, um, and it's, like, being attached by his, like, veins and bones and stuff, and, like, thread things, um, and they're just, like, coming off of him, and these worm things are, like, feeding on it. I love how his expression is just like, oh no, and not like, oh my lord! You know, this is where the gore, um, I was really sad that Inktober was ending, so that's why I made that one. And, <sighs> goodbye Inktober, goodbye guys, um, for now. Um, I want something in November, like, is there something in November? If there is, comment, please, because I need something. <laughs> like, these are so fun, because the prompts, and it just like there's like dates so it's like every day you draw something so it keeps you going and i love it it's like a like a, a i keep it as like a a due date but like i don't follow it so seriously like i try to but if i don't then i'm fine with it you know i love inktober and i'm so sad that it's gone i can't wait till next year and i'll probably be a lot better than this <laughs> next year but, uh, yeah, that's all I really have to say. So, yeah, see you guys next time. Happy Halloween. Um, and, yeah, goodbye.